For the first time since Alyssa Turnbull disappeared in Nipigon in the spring of 2020, provincial police have confirmed that they suspect foul play in the case. That came in a statement released today by the OPP on the eve of the two-year anniversary of her being reported missing. Turnbull's family continues to look for answers and closure, and they're pleading with anyone who has information to finally come forward. Lee Noonan reports. It's been two years since the OPP began investigating Alyssa Turnbull's disappearance, and they're now confirming that foul play is suspected. Detective Inspector Daryl Sigwin has issued a statement saying there are people out there who have information about what happened to her. And he says, We want to bring resolution to Alyssa's family and ensure those who were associated to her disappearance can pose no further threat to the communities we serve. We will leave no stone unturned in order to bring Alyssa home. For Turnbull's family, the pain is still very raw. Her mother, Deborah Otway, says they live every day with a parent's worst nightmare, not knowing where Alyssa is. She deserves to live, laugh, grow, have fun, sing, dance with her friends, watch her siblings grow up. Just live the life a young woman deserves to live. Um, we're plagued with worry, unanswered questions. And uh, it's very hard to move forward in our lives without her. Sharing videos of Alyssa, photos and mementos, her family remembers her as a goofball, someone who was comfortable in her skin and not afraid to be silly to get a laugh. The 26-year-old was living in Nipigon the last time she was seen. Both her parents are just waiting for someone to come forward. I'm beyond the hurt. Um, I'm angry, very angry. I know there's people out there that know where Alyssa is. is. Um, you know, they've taken away our closure. They've taken away her life. And we're just pleading with anybody, somebody to please come forward and tell us something. I just want to bring her home and try to find some peace in our lives, if that's even possible anymore. The province is offering a $50,000 reward for information leading to Turnbull's location or a conviction in her case. Anyone who has information is asked to contact the OPP, Crime Stoppers, or their local police service. Lee Noonan, CBT News.